fucking yanked it. Each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. I hate to see a creature get put down like that. Revelio. Greetings, young Slytherin. Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Fee. Scrope can help you. And you can help Scrope get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially Professor Black. Oh, nobody is here but tell Handy him resource type indeed. of fucking you're shit. Right. Well, then let's do another main quest. Oh, I wonder if you might be able to help stuff. me with a small. You wanted to speak with me. I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course, confronting trolls and dragons. That's nice to hear. I have had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is, in fact, warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a, a puff scheme. Surely you're joking. You can't possibly be afraid of a puff scheme. It may seem irrational to you, but my experience with them has been most upsetting. They eat bogies, you know. Regardless Ew. of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even well, taken to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. Everett said the same thing. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think since I have been in the hidden herbology corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. How about you? Fuck off! You pussy ass fucking bitch hmm. boy! Hidden herbology corridor. Sounds intriguing. It does, doesn't it? Well, we are about to go in there and fucking. It's a relief to finally have an answer. Hold on. Incendium. I'm going another one bites the dust. Let me grab that and get the fuck going. These fraternals are a bunch of fucking cowards to do anything on, on their own. Like motherfuckers, are you all really that goofy? Oh well, let's go figure that out. Hold on. Incendio. I simply avoid Thank you for that. Rebellion. We are the truly a master of this game. I'm joking, I'm not. I'm just a villain who loves this game. Not loves it, but enjoys it. Accio. Come here, you damn bitch. Rebellion. We are level 18. Grab that as well. <laughs> 
Akio. Incendio. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming kindling. Oh shit, that lag. What the fuck? This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. You know what? I wanna know what's up here. Akio! Incendio! Akio! Incendio! Lumos! Seems the devil's snare was protecting the chest of some kind. Incendio! Lumos. Accio. Incendio. Revelio. Glasses. Oh yeah, defense. Here we go. We do look goofy, but whatever. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. Incendio. Incendio Lumos What a goofy ass bitch Imagine being scared of that Let me listen. Ooh. Ooh. Hundred and forty. Now that's a deep fucking go ooh oh offen offense. Oh I need to do this too. We're gonna get expelliarmus. Fun time. Oh, Ooh, more of offense. New inventory slot unlocked. 
That's magnificent. Let's go talk to that fucking coward. What a pussy ass bitch he is. <laughs> Have you found anything to, uh, prove- Hello, Duncan. I have the proof you wanted. That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. It's even more than I expected. I knew you were the one to ask. I appreciate you getting it for me. Nah, now that it. I think about it, puff scheme Dunkeen, I think I shall keep this. You need to overcome your cowardice. You can't be serious. <gasps> this is awful. I don't know what to do now. I'm doing you a favor. Disappointment like this will encourage you to become a stronger person. I don't need to be stronger. I need to be left alone. Even Zenobia Noak will make fun of me now. You've wasted oh my time. You're not who I thought you were. Well, I am a Slytherin. What the you. fuck did you expose? Shut the hell up, you clown. Fucking asshole. Oh, boy, who is that? You wouldn't oh. help me. Wow. Go cry about it. Like I said from the start, I'm not going to be nice. I might get a hit for it, but <laughs> bro, I don't give a shit. Akio. I'm just here to play the game. Scrope? Who is Scrope? He literally called you a while ago. You ignorant asshole. Levioso! Akio! Pumpkins. Ah, I think I know just the place. Why well, you? I thought you were the nice person. No, I'm not. I'm literally in the Slytherin. Slytherins are assholes. What the fuck did that moron expect? Rebellion. Down to the water's edge. Hmm, this had better not be a trick. Incendio. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. R 
Dangerous in my ass. But no, we did find a chest, so I digress. Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Undermining the headmaster and getting something in return. Continue. Oh, Scrope does not intend to undermine the headmaster. In fact, Scrope wants to surprise him. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Thank you, Scrope my guy. Wait right here for you. <laughs> yeah, you fucking do that. Well, let's uh, do this uh, side quest for funsies. Incendio. Potato. Fuck off. You damn blunt. Well, let's find that thing. We should have done the garbage thing, but whatever. Uh. It's gonna be fun during a couple of longer sessions. Because of the fact that... Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes.
Hey guys, it's for the Kraken. You silly goofus. Or silly doofus. And open sesame. There you go, look at that. Shiny little door. Could it be? A visitor? <laughs> ah, the name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah, sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. I must insist that you give them to me at once. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest and I'll show you where to find the pages. What a fucking idiot. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Just fucking gross, so we don't care. Uh huh. So it's. I don't know where the fuck that is. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Alright, oh, let's get moving. That was a fucking reckon of a door. <laughs> That's funny shit. Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Alright, uh, we shall start doing that fucking quest. Uh, let's uh, do uh, this one. Alright, where is it now? Floating bundles. So where I assume that's the thing, that's the forest. Get this done. Uh, I 
I suppose we have to do uh, the attack thing. Where can I find a bunch of assholes who need to fight? Floating... Lumos! Shit. Some more moonstone. What do I do here? I know what that means. Merlin trial. Now, where could it be at? Oh, right here. Another one. I don't have the stuff needed for it. Rebellion. <laughs> you let Nora Treadwell go, didn't you? Yes.